How's it going YouTube? Sick Eric back again with another video and today we're going to be going over a cool app that I downloaded off of XDA. Now this app is a alpha app. I will post a link in the description down below. Now essentially what this does is this gives you the option to double tap the back of your phone to get different features and to activate different actions just like you can on the iPhones with the new update and some Pixel phones as well. You do have the option to just double tap the back of your phone and it will launch different things. So right now I have it set for the Google Assistant. So if I double tap, it'll, well actually I have it for a screenshot. And then if you double tap, it'll do Google Assistant as well. So that is really, really cool. See right there, if you just double tap the back of it, it will bring up Google Assistant. So that's really, really nice. Um, it is an alpha, so let's go ahead and jump into the app to show you. Now this app is called Tap Tap, so it's really, really cool. Once you download it, you do have to down, uh, accept accessibility, which you're just going to go ahead and click on that, and you're going to find Tap Tap and turn that on. So that's pretty much all you got to do with this app in order to use it. So let's go ahead and go back and go into Tap Tap. Now you do have different options. You have gesture tweak on how the gesture work so you do have your device model now I didn't really mess with this a lot you can change it I just pretty much just put it on pixel 4 it will work the same either way sensitivity there's nothing to do there as far as your actions go you click on that you can add different actions on here now they're gonna go in order so depending on which one is running uh, it's not going to do the other one if that makes any sense it's gonna go in order uh, like if one's running right here and you do it again, it's going to take a snap a screenshot But uh, you can move these around and you can add actions on here. So if I move this up here Flashlight that's going to be the first one. So if I double tap on the back It will bring up the flashlight double tap again. It'll turn off the flashlight So that's really really nice and you do have the option to add different actions so you can launch an app or you can launch Google Assistant, or you can launch the camera. So if you want to launch an app, just go over here and you could pick an app that you want to launch. So let's go ahead and just go into Facebook. So if I double tap, it should bring up, you're just gonna switch that up, long press, and then put that as the first one. And then, so now when I double tap on the back, it'll launch Facebook for you. So that's really, really cool that you could do stuff like that and add different functionality to it. And you can also remove these. So if I click on that one, I could just remove, drag it down to the bottom and remove that one. And then you click over here, you do have actions that you could launch. So you can do a screenshot, open notifications, quick settings, home, back, and open recents. And you do have the option to lock the phone as well. So if I click on lock the phone, drag this long press and drag this to the top. So now if I double tap, it should lock the device like that. So that's really, really cool that you can do stuff like that with this. So it's very customizable and you can do a whole bunch with this. So go back again to add action and then actions. And then these are all the different types of op options. You can also wake the device. You could play and pause music. You could do previous, you could do next. You could do show volume panel. So if I click on that and then drag this one up to the top. So now if I double tap, it should show the volume panel, panel which is really, really nice. So you do have the option to do whatever you want on here as far as actions go to do that to, and to add them on here. And then if you go into advanced, uh, right now, there are no advanced features. They're working on combining this with Tasker integration and everything, but they are coming soon. Like I said, this is an alpha app. And then if you want to do utilities, you can do your flashlight, which I already have on there. So if I drag this up to the top, long press, and drag it up to the top if I want it, I can just double tap and it'll turn on your flashlight for you and then it'll turn it off for you as well. So that's really, really cool. As far as anything goes, like as far as turning it on, if you tap the sides, it really won't do anything. If you set your phone down, it shouldn't do anything as well. Only if you double tap 
right around the center. If you double tap over here at the bottom, it'll do it as well. Anywhere else, double tap on the camera, it'll also do it. If you double tap on the front, it really won't do anything as far as launching an app. So it's really, really cool. You do have different functionalities in here and it's a really, really nice app if you want some extra things. Uh, then you go on over to the gates option and you do have the option to set it to where you don't want anything to happen if your screen is off. So if your screen is off and you double tap, it shouldn't do anything for you. That way you don't have any accidental, you know, touches or you don't accidentally turn on your flashlight when it's in your pockets. And you do have the option to do when screen is on. Block gestures when the screen is on. You can do block gestures when the screen is off. Uh, you can do block gestures USB device on call or when charging. And if you want to add a gate, you could add a gate. So block gestures when you're using the camera, that way you don't you know, accidentally hit anything when you're trying to record or when there's an app showing like block gestures, when an app is showing on the screen, you can do things like that and add some more gates on there. As far as settings goes, that's pretty much it. This is an alpha version 0.2 and I'll post a link in the description to go on over to this thread and you can download this. I don't have my internet on, but I will post the link in the description now you guys can go check this out on XDA. So really, really cool app, uh, really cool functionality on it. You can set your double tap to pretty much do whatever you want. Uh, you can launch Google Assistant. It's just really, really nice. This app is called Tap Tap. Really, really cool looking app. Gives you a little bit more features to your phone. You can use this on a Samsung device. This is the OnePlus 8. I've tried it on my uh, Samsung Galaxy Note 9 and it does work. And uh, I'm pretty sure it'll work on any other smartphone as well. So really, really cool. Links will be posted in the description down below that way you guys can check this app out. Tap Tap. Go on over to XDA, download it, mess with the settings, and you will be happy. It's a really, really cool and fun app. So with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did, thumbs down if you didn't. If you have any questions on setting this up, comment down below, and I will try to help you as much as I can. And you guys stay safe out there. Subscribe and like this video and all that other crap. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.